Everyone, it's Nellie again. This is the second part of a two-part video for teachers and I suppose carers and anyone who uh, might be reading my books to kids. Just to give you some teacher's notes. I don't know what teacher's notes are, but I think they're supposed to help you um, in, you know, helping you understand the intention behind the books and so on. So the first one I wrote um, was called Some Girls. And as I said in the first video, I don't shy away from the fact that there's a conscious and deliberate effort in this book to undermine stereotypes about what it is to be a little girl. Um, I've got two girls myself and one of the things that I was shocked about when I started buying them books as little girls, you know, 12 years ago, was how persistent those stereotypes of, you know, girls like pink and play with the shake and bake and, you know, they're caring and they don't do anything active and all those things we know about how persistent they were even in modern books. Um, now I hasten to add, if you have a little girl who loves pink and, you know, wants to play with, you know, Barbies and all the rest of it, that's perfectly fine with me. Like I have one of each, to be honest, but it's about honoring, um, a wide variety of ways in the world to be a girl. So I don't think there's much for me to go through. Honestly, in lots of ways, this book was the easiest one to write because it's empowering. It's pretty much about saying, you know, you can, as a girl, like science and maths and playing in the dirt. You are allowed to get mad. You don't have to be sweet and kind all the time. Girls pick their nose too. Girls can be gross. They like to play rough things. You know, some of them are good with art and some of them are good at maths. Some are good at everything. Um, going through the different things that girls wear, that's probably weirdly the biggest sticking point. Um, because there's still a lot of resistance, even though we all know that girls often wear tracksuit pants and jumpers and jeans and things like that. We don't see that very often in kids' books. They're usually in dresses. Um, so there's a bit of resistance to that. But look, this page probably um, sums up the book, really. It's about honouring different types of girls, making sure a range of girls see themselves uh, in the book. And really just saying to girls and boys that girls can be, you know, whoever they want. And before you email me, I don't mean whoever they want in the sense that not everyone's going to be, you know, an astronaut. I was never going to be a ballerina. Like, I'm not an idiot, you know. Like, I get it. We can't all be absolutely anything. Um, but what I am saying is don't let the stereotypes that were handed down by someone else tell you what you can be. Mm -hmm.